Right. Basically, Stu, <clears throat> what you need to do here yeah, is find, say like you start from here, by the gate, and you're going to spawn in here. I've got to show you the long route because I don't know if you've unlocked it. And then if you follow this road down, yeah, and then up, you'll come across this church here. You probably won't have it um, unlocked yet, so just put a little marker down. And then just literally ride your horse all the way over. You could either follow this road and then chuck a left, or you could just aim for where you put your mark. Literally, it gets a whole lot quicker though, once you've unlocked this church, just wait. <clears throat> right, from here, there's a statue there, yeah? This is the church here. So from the start, yeah, you know you got the gate and that. If you've got that one unlocked there, then just come down this road and just follow the road all the way up. And it'll bring you to the church. Or, if you do what I do, just go there, put a mark by the church like I did there. Then as soon as you cross the bridge, you could just beeline it straight down. But it's this one there. And then once you come here, you get one of them sacred tear things from this and you could pick up a flask that you could then conjure up. It's actually useful. That one. You could like add your own shit into it. It's banging. But then yeah, once you're here, Stewie boy, and you've done what you need to do, let me know. But I need you to get to this um, church first before I carry on.
Are you there yet, laddie? Is that you, I see? Stay bag. Talk to me, boy. From here, yeah, you see where the statue is. To the right of the statue, there's an opening. You're gonna go through that, come round the back of the church, over this little rock, and then you're gonna see blue lights in this corner. Right? See the lights? You're just gonna come over here, and then there's a little teleporter. You examine that, press yes, and it takes you to the next step. Might as well quickly do that while you're watching. <clears throat> right, and then once you've done that, you're going to be facing this big castle. You want to turn yourself around, so you're facing the giant fucking bird, whatever the fuck it is. Get your horse out and ignore it and just literally keep going straight. Just follow this road straight. You're going to see one of them little tree things there. So pick up the uh, sacred tear or whatever it is from that. Make sure you don't get shot by them. Because, yeah, they can't. But yeah, pick that up. Keep going straight until you see the bridge down there. Right, you want to hit that site of grace there. Rest at it, do whatever. We're nearly there, Stu. We're nearly there. Literally, I'm not joking, you could get about 7,000 runes per minute. If you grind it up, it's well quick. Right, from here... No, 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 quick, look. 
I'll show you one more time, right? From the church. Look, the church is here. I'll load back into the church now. Right, this church here, like I said, look at the big statue. Yeah. And just to the right of the statue, there's an opening. Yeah. You literally just want to be going directly behind this statue. So come out the back, now through this opening. And there's a couple of rocks in front of you. Just jump straight over the rocks and then just run forward. Like run forward and you'll see this light. See this light? You literally go up to here, examine that, and that's the teleport where it teleports you to where you need to go. So, right, and then once you've teleported here, like I said, just turn right round, get your horse, and just ignore, literally, just ignore everything, bruv. But yeah, make sure you get your little sac sacred tail or whatever from the tree. Because then you could get an extra flask. Extra potion. Even these, yeah, these give you like a good thingy as well. Just trying to kill him now. Like, look at that. That's a thousand per one of them. This area is banging. But that's not the good bit. The good bit's so much quicker. And you ain't even got to fight it. So yeah, come to this um, site of grace. Do that. And then once you have done that, you need to open your map. And you're gonna come to this little bridge down here. Right, so mark this bridge. And then you're gonna go up this little route here. Again, just skip everyone. And once you're down at this little bridge, just straight in front of it, is the last checkpoint. Right, you rest here, and then this is where the farm is. Mate, you're gonna literally laugh when you realise how easy this is. So this is the place you want to be here. You're there, yeah? Right. Watch closely. You're going to need your horse. So you get on your horse. Yeah. You come down this hill. And then there's a little rock there, you see the little rock poking out? Once you get past this point, you're going to want to turn your camera around. An enemy's going to spawn, and then you just pan to the left. It rolls off the cliff. Boom! 2,000 runes. And then, you just go... Fast travel back to that point. You call your horse. You run down the hill. You see the rock, you spin your camera around, 
the boss spawns or whatever it is, you just pan to the left. Another 2,000 runes. Rinse and repeat. Rinse and repeat. Rinse and repeat. Easy leveling. Cheese in the game. But bro, you could do it like four times a minute. Literally, run down here four times a minute. It's like 8k per minute. 8k runes. And you can't mess up. Even if you somehow die, your runes are still there anyways. It's as simple as that, bro. Now enjoy all your free runes, mate. Oh yeah, basically what you want to do is make sure you keep watching. Like, make sure you watch it as it goes down. That's what I found. There's a couple of times that happened to me as well. But it hasn't happened since I've like locked onto it. But yeah, once you get the hang of actually doing it, it becomes so quick. And then you literally just speed run the fucking thing until you do what I've done. Ooh, what a recovery! Shit, I didn't get on them, but I nearly fucking fell to me death. But yeah, make sure it don't um, hit you, because even for me, it's a one hit, bruv. But yeah, that's that.